Hey there, friends. Today we're playing Breath Edge, a game that sends you to space with only a chicken. What the hell is going on here? Is the chicken in control? Why am I strapped up like this? Wait, what is this? The Red Ruin Softworks team is categorically against smoking, which causes loud headlines in newspapers and other diseases. Therefore, we suggest that you replace this dangerous cigarette in the robot's claw for something more useful. Okay. Censorship. There you go. Now it's a fish. <laughs> oh, no, it's a carrot. Okay, perfect. Nothing relieves stress like smoking a carrot. Hey, speaking of addictive, you're being kind of a dick now as well. Can you stop hitting me? No. Spit in the face of this piece of iron. Yeah, go for it. Oh my god, that was a lot of spit. Ah, oh, he's got wipers built in. <laughs> this game is great already. You tell us that you fly to the funeral, but the liner explode radicals of green universe. Confirm? I don't know what he's saying, so I'm just gonna spit again. <laughs> I love spitting. It's actually a medical condition. I'm not annoyed with you at all. Stop hitting me because of my medical condition. I don't know how many more hits I can take before I just die <laughs> or run out of spit. I got an Chief and BDSM <laughs> Oh, that's not something I wanted on my profile. Okay, I'm gonna stop before I get another achievement like spit fetish or something. <laughs> Okay, so me telling him actually starts the game, I suppose, because this is the story of how we got there. <laughs> Otherwise, the game would have just been Spitting Simulator, which honestly, I would be down for. Wait, there's a funeral in space? Oh, my chicken! Sorry, this is an emotional moment. I just, I'm thinking of McNuggets. Oh god, there's been a breach, and there goes my dad, friend, waiter, I don't know. You lie to me. Hey, stop hitting me or I'll spit at you again. Could not see the shuttle from space. <laughs> I like how he's no, saying I couldn't see no, the game no. logo in space. <laughs> yeah. All right, continue the story. That's not how it went. I just didn't want to tell you the real story. Because the truth is, in space, no one can see you spit. Oh, careful, you're choking your chicken, dude. And get your mind out of the gutter. I had to go away and take a phone call. And I left him where there was a leak of oxygen. Just standing there, freaking out. Take chewing gum. Ooh, is chewing gum a useful item in space? Oh, wait, maybe I can plug it with the chewing gum. Oh, or the chicken. That, yeah, that works too. <laughs> is that, oh, no. Oh, this game is so much different than I thought it would be. It's great. Oh, my poor chicken has gas. <laughs> All right, do I have um, another item I can use? Can I use the chewing gum? There we go. Perfect. Oh, carrot top. Ah, oh, it's already smoked. Feck. Alcohol. Yeah, that's all I need as an Irishman in space. Find the interphone or get depressed is my task. <laughs> this is brilliant. Okay, so it was my grandpa, apparently. What a creepy photo of my grandpa. Was he too close to that chicken? Ah, oh, yes, fixed. I like my guy. He has very similar methods to me. Don't forget to feed the chicken. Oh, God. I can't even take care of myself. Never mind a chicken. Check the antenna. Is the antenna outside? Can I even go outside? Wait, what is this? A survival guide? Yeah, I'll take that. Can I actually play this? Oh, fantastic. To pee or not to pee? Space, so dangerous, so unpredictable, just like your bladder. Oh, no, I didn't know this would be graphic content. Okay, that actually helps. Well, not the bathroom part, but... Uh, now I know I need a helmet to go outside. Oh, wait, I have my helmet on. Okay, can I just leave the ship then? Yep, <laughs> I didn't really stop to think about that. Thank God it worked. Let's go check the antenna. There we go. You've broken the antenna completely. Oh, it's gone. Yeah, that didn't help. Judging by the primary analysis of the destruction, most of the passengers of the liner died. This might be the biggest catastrophe in the history of astronautics. The Why do you sound so happy about that? <laughs> I think I hit a moon or something. <laughs> do I have moon insurance? Remember that you are still able to become depressed. Thanks for reminding me. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I need a debugging station. And for that, I need two metal and wire. And for that, I need to drink my alcohol. <laughs> oh, probably a bad idea. I'll be fine. Drunk in space. Yeah, this is great. I cannot think of a worse combination. I found some ice. Okay, I can drink that. Well, eat it or drink it, depending on what mood I'm in. Oh, metal. Okay, great. I'm running out of oxygen and I've not found what I need. Yeah, affect this. Affect this. Get back in the ship. Oh, no. Why did I leave it? Get down to single digits of oxygen oxygen supply. Let me in, let me in, let me in, let me in, let me in. Okay, thank God. Ah, oh, back scratcher. Nice. It has a nipple gripper. Oh my God, he was into some weird shit. I thought the chicken was bad. Oh, look, I see dead people. I hope they have valuables. Oh, I can grab the corpse. <laughs> Yeet. Oh, this looks like it has wire, but it also looks pretty dangerous. Neutralize it. Oh yeah, I should have known with the chicken. <laughs> Sorry about that, dude. <laughs> this chicken's getting a lot of abuse. Grandpa would be spinning in his grave. Well, he probably is spinning in his grave because his grave got yeeted off into space. Wire. Yes. Got it. <laughs> 
<laughs> I found a pack of cigarettes, but I censored it. So now it's a pack of carrots in my story. All right, this is the machine I need. There we go. And, oh, oh, this is what I made? Okay, I'm not very good at crafting things. <laughs> I'm so glad I made this. It's so good for a troubleshooting. All right, now I can call for help. The estimated arrival time of the rescue team is 4,364 years. Okay, I'm on my own. What is this? Is that like his actual significant other? Or is this just uh, there are signals in your area? Because if that's the case, you really can't escape them, can you? Like, look at my area. Where are the singles? Okay, at least I have some water to cool down. There we go. I was getting very dehydrated. <laughs> What the hell is this? Stop messaging me. Right, I can make this handy scrapper, whatever the hell that is. And then I'll need a drill and a grabber. It's saying I need to create the crap imposed by the developers and put it in your hands. And I was like, what the hell does that mean though? But in the actual crafting menu, there's crap imposed by the developers. So I guess I should get to work on that. So I need two refined metal, one wire and thick electric tape. Okay, at least I have this tool now. I can break things down, but I don't know how to like refine metal. I hope this doesn't get too complicated. Well, I got the electrical tape. Is that refined? Refined metal? It kind of looks like refined metal. Oh no, that's rubber. <laughs> okay. I don't think I'm trained enough to be out in space. <laughs> Jesus Christ, what the hell is this ship? What is going on here? Feckin' hell. Okay, so I can make refined metal here. I can't remember how much I need for it. I think it was two. And then crap imposed by the developers. <laughs> Let's see what this actually does. I have no idea. Okay, what the hell is it? Hit yourself. Okay, yeah, is this helping? I got a concussion. <laughs> oh, god damn it. You lie again. You are here. That means death was impossible. Death was impossible. Yeah, I, I actually didn't die by hitting myself in the head. I misremembered the story. Lord Autosave, please still have that thing made. Don't let me lose progress because I beat myself over the head with some metal. Okay, it's not too bad. <laughs> it's not great, but it's not too bad. I still got to make the thing. Oh, no, I lied. I don't have the equipment. Okay, I'll be right back. <laughs> I'm definitely not beating myself over the head with anything else after that. Wait a second. I got all the stuff and then I realized now I have two of them. Okay. <laughs> well, <laughs> oh well. <laughs> I've done it twice. Okay, do I just install this anywhere? I guess, where, where's out of the way? On the ceiling, perhaps? That doesn't work. <laughs> There's gravity in here. I think that literally does nothing. It was just a tutorial on how to make stuff, pretty much. And I made two of them. <laughs> God, I'm dumb. All right, it's saying to go to the extraction point, but I'm assuming that won't work. 1,500 meter. Oh my God. Yeah, there's no no way I can go that far. As you get closer, radiation rises too. Okay, so we're just gonna have to work on the ship, I guess. You can make whole new parts of the ship as well, but that might be a bit out of my league right now. Need to find some blueprints. There's another objective down here. Stop messaging me. How do you block someone in this game? <laughs> I need a handy scrapper. Oh, don't I have that? Yeah, there we go. I'll just beat up the door. Scan the scanner with the scanner to record the scanner damage. It broke. All right. It turns out my uh, little contraption wasn't as strong as that metal door. I'm stripping the whole ship that I am currently surviving in. Probably not a good idea, but it's done now. It looks kind of funky, I guess. I didn't even need the fabric. I just wanted to try out my new tool. I'm gonna need more metal if I want to make another scrapper, but ah, oh, it's gonna be annoying to find without the scrapper in the first place. I should have kept a stockpile. Wait, one of these objectives is... I thought that was a bell, but no, it's a condom. A large condom may be useful, come to think of it. What? <laughs> Dude, I'm really fearing for this chicken. Against my greater judgment, There's we're gonna no go collect this. <laughs> what the hell is it? Okay, I can't seem to pop it. Probably a bad idea anyway. It... It looks like there's some sort of oxygen reservoir down there, though, pumping into that balloon. Maybe that'll come in handy. Okay, so I can make an oxygen balloon now that I've looked at it, but I need a condom to do it. <laughs> and I don't really understand where I'm supposed to find one. Okay, so I'm out in space trying to find a condom. <laughs> Let's see how this goes. <laughs> Jesus, you got a bad death, didn't you? Feckin' hell, crushed by video games. I knew video games were bad for us all. All right, I have two handy scrappers now, and I'm gonna go down, and I'm gonna break open that door. I'm gonna make that chicken proud of me. Okay, I'm slowly but surely breaking my way in. I'm like halfway there, which means I should be able to do it with my second tool. Oh, I know, I know, I know, I know. Okay, I'll go, I'll go. I need oxygen. I need oxygen or a condom, one or the other. That's a weird request, I know. Oh no, five, four, three, two, one, don't die on me. Come on. We're good. We're good. We're good. We're fine. Yes, there we go. You just have to hold your breath for two seconds. Come on. Don't be a baby. <gasps> Yeah, stop hyperventilating. None of us care. All right, I'm going back down there and I'm getting in through that door. I want to know the mysteries that are behind it. All right, what do we got here, huh? An oxygen station. Ooh. 
Mine. Neutralize that electricity with the chicken. <laughs> Thank you, chicken. <laughs> You're my hero. Okay, I think that's it. I need to get out of here. Don't want to die. Even though my oxygen is very good. I think I was actually safe in there. Oh, my bad. I panicked for nothing. Oh, for feck's sake, for the scanner, I need a light bulb. To find a light bulb, I'd need to have a really good idea, and that's never happened before. And for the oxygen station, I need aluminium, which I have yet to see. Okay, so I'm looking for aluminium, light bulb, and a condom, <laughs> strangely enough. Scan right now. Okay, <laughs> my chicken isn't authorized. It's probably the only Ooh, I got a bit of a zap, but he's got an eye I can take. Has anyone ever told you you've beautiful eyes? Well, beautiful eye. That's mine. <laughs> okay, that got me stuff, uh, paint, great. I want to welcome back. I think I'll turn that off. <laughs> All right, I've made a drill and I can extract aluminium here, which I need, I think, to advance. <laughs> I hope this is what I need. Yeah, that's what I need for the grabber. So now I just need some metal, which I think I can make. Yay! Now plenty of oxygen candles because I'm going pretty far out here. Okay, so I need glass and oh, I need a lot of stuff for that, but I'm, <laughs> I'm mainly focusing on the helmet for now. I need glass. Oh God, I'm kind of freezing up. Oh, I don't know if this was a good idea. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to get the glass. Yeah, I'm... <laughs> I'm gonna die. I cannot see a thing. I am going to die. <laughs> I, I don't know what to do. I guess I could have a beer. That might help me. Okay, I'm dying. <laughs> there's, there's no way I can do this. Can I load? Please have a nearby save. Okay, I think this was just before I headed it out, was it? All right, let's try this again. I bet I can make it. I just gotta be more careful about the cold. Yes, yes, I followed the light like a moth and it helped. Yeah, grab, 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 grab. I need glass. I don't want to come back here. Oh shit, my oxygen. Okay. Oh God, I hope I can make it back because I got some glass. Oh, sweet Jesus. Oh no, I'm icing over again. Oh, I can't think of anything more terrifying. Like I'm going towards my ship, but we're in space and I can't see a thing. Now we play the game, who can hold their breath the longest? <laughs> I'm gonna try as well, I'm gonna go along with it. When he runs out of oxygen, I'm gonna hold my breath and see could I make it. I only have 200 meters to go by the looks of it. <gasps> Weak! <laughs> I was holding my breath way longer than you. Take yellowish water out of a toilet? Really? A dead hamster. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> what is this game? How the hell am I going to get there? Get the glass and get back. To be fair, maybe I could have executed the plan a bit better last time. Oh, I spy another body. Oh, Jesus Christ. Oh, I grabbed it. Okay. It freaked me out when it started moving. But I forgot I kind of touched it myself. I'm breaking open people's mail. I know it's a crime, but maybe the cops will actually come get me and get me out of this mess. Oh, oh, I found a condom. <laughs> Interesting. It's just floating around in that box. What did I need this for again? Oh, yes. The oxygen balloon. I just have no idea what this is going to do, but I'm willing to give it a try. Anything with oxygen will help my quest for glass. Aha, uh -huh, so it gives me way more oxygen. Okay, this is brilliant. This is great news. You know what? I'm gonna have a nice glass of water and I'm gonna go to sleep so I have more health and I can hold my breath longer and I'm gonna get that glass. All right, let's feckin' do this. I'm feckin' ready. Feck. <laughs> Sorry, just enjoying swearing. My parents can't give out to me when I'm in space. Even though I don't think feck is really considered a swear, but my parents are extremely strict despite me being 27. Okay, I think that's the area lighting up there that I can defrost. So I'm gonna aim straight for that because I'm not gonna be able to see in a second. Yes, clear it, clear it. Okay, okay. No, no, need need glass. Where glass? I'm panicking and I don't know why. Where's the glass? <laughs> Here it is. Here it is. Grab it, grab it. Grab it. Back to ship. Back to ship. No man left behind. <laughs> oh god, no, you're heavy. Man left behind. No, don't frost over. Come on. Come on, stop. I'm out of the frozen area. Stop it. Yes, yes. Okay, come on. I'm almost there. Less than 200 meters. My oxygen is running out. Dude, you have to hold your breath. Shit. The music is really fitting. I don't know if I'm gonna make it. Oh, it's gonna be really close if I make it or not. Come on, 50 meters, but my health is running out. Oh, Jesus. I just went to bed. I'm <laughs> so stressed. I'm just like, nah, man, I'm sleeping. <laughs> okay, I can make a better helmet. That's something. The protection level against radiation is still insufficient for the flight to the evac point. You still need to improve the equipment or click exit game in the menu of your spacesuit, which will solve all your problems. <laughs> Thanks for the advice. And to make the suit, I need roll of fabric, lead paint, and aluminium. Do I have some of that? Roll of fabric? Okay, at least I have that. That's something. I didn't tear apart my spaceship earlier for nothing, I guess. Lead paint and aluminium. Okay, uh, lead paint. I 
swear I had some lead paint. Oh, that's an eye. No, <laughs> maybe he used it on the helmet, but at least I know roughly where to get them, I think. Oh, I found a light bulb, but didn't I need that for something earlier? <laughs> I can't remember. All right, time to go get what I need. Lead paint. And then I think I'll have the full space suit and I can try and get to the evac point. Lead plate. Perfect, perfect. I need this, I need this. Oh, I hope I have enough oxygen to get home. I'm starting to think I don't. All right, I hope I got enough. Ah, uh, we're playing the fun game of let's hold our breath or we'll die again. Oh, yeah, yeah, I love that game. Very fun. Oof, that was great. All right, I can make lead paint, thank God. Equipment. Enhanced spacesuit. Yay! Right, I made an accelerator, so hopefully I can go faster. That would have been very handy, <laughs> but better late than never, I guess. Now all I need is like a load of batteries so I can try and get some oxygen as I move around. God damn, this accelerator's good. God damn, I wish I had this earlier. Okay, I have some batteries. I made them into oxygen candles, and I think I'm ready to attempt to get to the extraction. I'm actually kind of scared because there's a few moving parts here, and one of them is that little thing in my tool I gotta set that up along the way to get oxygen somewhere, but I've never set one up So I'll have to do a mid-flight for the first time trying to avoid all the freezing areas, too But look, it's under a thousand meters away now. That's good I just hope there's nothing I need to do when I get there like a puzzle or some way of opening the door that requires interaction <laughs> No, don't freeze. That's the last thing I feckin need now is to freeze. Feck off <laughs> Feck off <laughs> Okay, good. Okay, good. I just got out of range. Oh, that was awful. No, don't equip P. <laughs> equip candle. Okay, I used my last candle. Uh, I hope I can make it. It's 400 meters away. I think it's doable. I have that oxygen station still, but I'm a little bit nervous about using it for the first time. Okay, I'm gonna need it. I'm gonna have to deploy this. Uh, install. Yeah, let's just put it down here anywhere. Yep, that's fine. Uh, refill oxygen. Ooh, yes, very good. More, more oxygen. I'm greedy. <laughs> okay, great. I don't know if I can move that afterwards but it had to be done even though I was almost there. I wasn't gonna make it. Oh, please let this be easy. How do I get in? What? What? Okay, at least I can breathe in here anyway. I don't know how to get in though. <laughs> Admin one, two, three. It's just written on the chicken. Fantastic. Okay, take the key. I like how it's just an ordinary key as well. All right, let's open this valve. It's good to lock up your space station, you know, in case it's a rough neighborhood or anything and some aliens come in and try and rob you. Wait, we're launching? I don't know. Okay, <laughs> I guess we're going. Oh, wait, hold on. No, I'm just here with my steering wheel. <laughs> oh, all right, maybe it was better off. Seems it will be a long day. Yeah, it really is a long, long day. Well, I tried my best, I suppose, but I think that's all I could do in one day, but this was so fun. All right, we are going to end it there. I hope you enjoyed our time and space with that chicken. Thank you very much for watching. If you enjoyed, please subscribe, and I hope to see you all tomorrow. Bye for now.